this your ledger? A list of slaves? God. Rewards. January 15th, Betsy, $17. January 18th, Louise, $12. May 18th, Wilfred, $18. May 24th, Minnie and Child, $20. Just a damn watch. Well, that's that. I was somewhere near Rhodes when they caught me. Till the day I die, I ain't gonna forget the sound of that dog barking in my heels. But I don't suppose that day gonna be far off yet. It was 50 lashings yesterday and 50 more to come. I don't think I can take any more. Man said he was doing his job. Funny kind of employment if you ask me, but I suppose you ain't. Lights fading, so that's it for now. I do hope I live to see the end of this war and justice win out. Ugh. June 64. Dear Mr. Thompson, after numerous complaints from customers and fellow employees alike, we must terminate your employment. There's just no place for a man like you at the Central Union Railroad Company. Dear Jeremiah, there ain't nothing here any value. I wouldn't give you a nickel for it. Come by for a sup of whiskey any time. Bill. Yes. I was sorry to hear of Betsy's passing. Things is easier up there for sure.
April 2nd, 1870. Dear Mr. Thompson, I'm afraid there's no more work for you down here at the plantation. I'm grateful for the help you've given us and the help your pappy and your pappy's pappy gave us before you. These are trying times for all of us. You are in our thoughts and prayers. Yours truly, Colonel J. Nixon, The Ascension Plantation. June 7th, 1855. Dear sir, please accept this likeness of your family as a small token of appreciation for your assistance in the recovery of my property. Like your old pa, you're a cunning old dog and a credit to this community. <laughs> Yours, Colonel Joshua Nixon, The Ascension Plantation. That's the old watch. You know what to do, girl. <laughs> Thank you. 
they needed us, they threw us away like, like shit on their boot. I'm, times wasn't perfect. I ain't saying that. It's just, it's all, it's all going to hell. Rack and ruin. Rack and damn ruin. Old man. Old man? <laughs> you sh show some respect. I was respected once. I had a profession. You asked my friend to get you something. There's no bringing back what I want. I want my job, my pride, the respect accorded to a gentleman. What about this crap? My things. Don't you understand? Those bastards, they changed everything. I was a good worker. I took pride in my work. They, they, they took it away. Pissed on my legacy. Oh man, some jobs ain't for saving. And some legacies? Oh, They're for pissing on. No, what, what are you doing? That's, that's my history. Damn you. Damn you. I still exist. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>